Hi guys! So today, I will be showing you how to create hyperlinked notebooks. Applications that I will be using are GoodNotes 5, Keynote, Procreate, and Magic Eraser. So I start creating my hyperlinked digital notebook by first creating a spiral metallic-like binder in Procreate. I am not artistic nor am I good at drawing but no worries because Procreate do the tricks. Just draw the shape that you wanted to draw and then do not remove yet the pencil unless you see that the shape is polished. Doing this will create an illusion of light being reflected on the ring. Now, I will create a hole so that the ring for the binder will look more realistic all together with the paper. Magic Eraser is an application in which you can have backgroundless images. Now that we have created our binder ring, we will now move on to creating the hyperlink digital notebook itself in Keynote. You can also create a ring binder in Keynote itself, but it was really hard creating one so I opt to create it in Procreate. As you can see, I am struggling rotating and moving the object. You have to turn on your guide so that you will have no problem in proportionately distancing every object that you have placed. You can also group objects so that you will have more control moving it.
you can go to document setup to change the size of your paper. I will now use the ring for the binder that I just have created a while ago by inserting the photo and then arranging it to look like a binder. I will now create a cover photo for the notebook. Click on the side and then select all to copy everything on the page. Now I will insert notebook pages by inserting a shape, the same thing that I've done with creating a notebook cover. You can insert shadow to make it look like a layered paper. I will now create bookmarks for the notebook. I am arranging the bookmarks by moving it at the back so that it will look like it is under the paper. Each pages have different bookmarks and every time I will be using a page, the bookmark is highlighted by moving it in the front. Now I will insert interactive links for each bookmark so that it will direct to the page that I wanted it to go. You just have to select the bookmark or the shape that you have created and then Select link and then choose the page that you wanted it to go. Now I will insert labels for each bookmark.
you also have to link this text to the pages that you wanted it to go because it is part of the bookmark. To check if the interactive links are working, you have to select the play button. Now I am exporting them to Kudotes 5. Some stickers I am inserting are from K Digital Studio. I will link down her YouTube channel so you guys might want to check her out. And also because she gives out free planners, notebooks, and stickers. You can also guys create a notebook in a horizontal form. So this is what I have made. Thank you for watching. See you guys in my next video.